Okay, another Sunday morning. <clears throat> a little overcast. A little bit of ice last night. It's a little slick out here. But it's fairly warm. 28 degrees. Going to do some more beef ribs today and a few other little interesting things. Uh, hopefully fill you in on the last ones of the beef ribs that I missed. Okay, our smoker's up to temp. Got some good smoke going. A little hickory today. Ribs are rubbed up. Gonna get them in there, start the timer, about three hours. Gonna do something a little different today. I'm gonna cook them meat side down. Last time uh, they shrunk up real fast with the bone side down. So uh, see how we do today after a few hours. Don't fall, I'll get yelled at. And we'll check back. All right, got some good smoke going there. Temperature's perfect. I'll let that go for a while. Go in the house. We got some other projects to do. <laughs> See what happens underneath the kitchen cabinet. You know, this might even work good for cutting the ribs later on. I'm not sure. But, uh,. We'll check back and try, I guess. All right, ribs are out there. We're in the house. Looks like Mama's making some homemade bagels. Some everything seasoning. Just whipped up some dough here. I think we're gonna try this in the air fryer. And we'll see how they come out. All right, bagels are prepared. Look at that, nice little Valentine heart bagels. Everything bagel should taste good. Oh, look, a couple Bloody Marys to get the day going. It is Daytona 500 Sunday, you know. All right, smoker's going good. So, uh, lo and behold, I come home yesterday. I got these fresh tracks. Hunting around my arborvitaes that the deer uh, have been nice enough to keep trimmed back for me this year again. And uh, as I walked along, of course... Try not to get killed on the ice here. Also walk down, I don't know if you can see out in the frozen tundra back there. I try and zoom you up. There are some piles of fresh deer poop around and there was three of them under the feeder last night. We gotta do a mo little more work on that. Maybe we'll get to that later. Okay, looks like our Valentine's breakfast is ready. Looking pretty good. Bagels look like they came out great. Okay, I know some of you have seen this movie before, but we're three hours in. I had the meat down and the bones up this time. And uh, it seems to have shrunk a little bit less. This might be uh, come out a little meatier. I'm going to give it a little spray. Keep it moist. Back in for a couple more hours. So in the midst of our smoking uh, project today, we're also making a new uh, floor base. You know the bottom of a cabinet under the kitchen sink it's taken a beating over the years just particle board we're gonna have to make two pieces to get them in there i've already solidified the the bottom of it with some blocking you're gonna get a little shot of it when it's done all right little under cabinet rebuild some blocking under there a couple new pieces there's a plastic tray that goes over this also it come out too bad, but it's not much fun fighting underneath the sink. Okay, so we're back at hour five. Uh, that probe is not doing the meat yet. That is just doing the temperature inside the smoker. It was just above 220. It's dropping now because it's open. I find that the uh, master-built thermometer here is close. If it reads just over 200, it's at 225, according to my probe there so we're gonna go a little while longer here we keep spritzing uh about every 15 minutes and uh then we'll start taking its temperature and see where we're at so as we do everything out here in the garage I actually gave myself a haircut out here today well pretty good what do you think i don't know why are you looking in that that's my ship's mirror, not yours. 
All right, got two probes going in there right now. Not too worried about the timer anymore. It meets at 192. And I brought the temp up there to about 268, it reads right now. And uh, I'm figuring we got about another half an hour in here to get that baby to about 206 or 203 in that general area. So check back. We filled the feeders, trail cameras back up, and we'll see if we get any visitors tonight too. So like I told you, got some visitors tonight. It was three. One walked by. But uh, these two are still out there. The one on the right's good eating. Now for the rest. Okay, plate it up. A little mac and cheese, a little uh, homemade sauce, a little homemade wine. And uh, rewind on the races. We're done tonight. I don't think that Daytona is going to run till tomorrow. Anyway, hope you guys had a good time with this. Uh, give me some comments, whether you liked, didn't like, or uh, suggestions. That would be great.